Hi guys, today I'm going to show you the new features of our updated Advanced SEO version 5. So once you've installed the add-on on your cart, um, let's do the settings first. So just go to manage and then you will see there are four tabs. Um, general information, so we have info, quick guide, and the logs for this version. So you can see we have a video sitemap feature. Um, webmaster verification for Google and Bing, fully updated and improved on-site optimi optimization tools. Um, you can also customize your 404 page or use your sitemap as your 404 page. We have template-based page title and meta description, duplicate content checked. We have easy self-installation and un uninstallation via uh, the CS card installer, optimized code so we have cleaned up our code structures and there are a lot of improvements under the hood. So you can click on this link for a complete guide of our change logs from our previous versions of advanced SEO. So under general general information, um, there are just guides on you know enabling default CS card Google Analytics add-on, um, disabling the Google sitemap add-on, and the link to the sitemap and there's also an important note there that um, for cards that are installed on Linux or Unix server, upon installation, we have an auto script actually that modified two, two of your core files from CS card. Um, we had to modify it um, to, for our add-on to work um, better on your card. You can find the original files at the directory um, provided. But don't worry, upon install, uninstallation, we will revert it with your original files. And you can also check out the backup files under this directory. So we have quick guides um, for our features. And this is the links. And then under the second tab, SEO settings. Um, here you can set, um, this is actually used for the optimization tool or of the suggestions when you do, for example, your product, product data, category data, your page or your content data, even your, your blog data. So we, you can also enable automatic canonical URLs for those pages. And then social dashboard, because we are also using different APIs, like we're using Bing LSI keywords, um, so aside from using your own keyword when you write a content, for example, a product description, we also tap into Bing to give you suggestions that are related to the keywords that you're using. So um, YouTube API key, um, this is for the video sitemap. So there's a, a link here that will give you a guide on how to generate your YouTube API key. This is needed, for example, if you embed a YouTube video on your product description. Um, once the video sitemap is generated, it will fetch um, the data for that video, like the duration, the description, the title. So it'll be um, in there on your video sitemap, which I will show you later on. So I already went ahead and created um, the account and added the keys. So for Bing LSI, um, just um, check on this link provided and it will give you different subscriptions. So their free subscription is a 5,000 transactions per month subscription. If you go beyond that, you have to pay certain fees. And then we also have webmaster verification. Um, just sign up on this link for your Google Webmaster Tools account and for your Bing Webmaster Tools account. Um, so webmaster verification is basically just um, telling the, the search engines like Google and Bing that you own this website and this website is verified by you. So it wouldn't be considered, you know, a spam site or something like that. And then we have um, rich snippets also, um, Facebook settings to um, enable open graph meta tags and also Twitter cards. And then we have template based page titles. These are the default short codes and this is how it is arranged but you can just rearrange them 
the way you want it to so that when you go to your category page or your product pages that's how the page title will be shown so once you've um, set up your settings just click on save and you can go check out our other features so under website we have here manage advanced SEO and we have four important features there um, import export 301 redirects custom 404 page internal links and video sitemap so as you can see um, CS card has already a default function wherein you can add 301 redirects but right now you can only add it individually so in the future if you want to um, add multiple um, 301 redirects in one go you can just use our import and export 301 redirects function so um, the format here is just the old URL the new URL object ID if you know the ID for example if it's a product you use the product ID if it's a category the category ID and then the type whether it's a page a product or a category so so I have a sample here let's so this is the advanced SEO import sample so this is the sample old URL and then the new URL and the type if it's a product a category custom meaning it's not a product category it's just a custom um, URL and then so when you go to SEO 301 redirects you can see those imported um, 301 redirects so next is the custom 404 error page so in here you have two options you change the content or you could use the sitemap as 404 page meaning if they don't find the page they're looking for it will redirect to the sitemap instead or if you put in a content it will show the content this is a test 404 page and you could also add an image there okay there for example and then we just save it so if ever you go on to a page that you read, you do not know so you see it will give us the 404 error page not found or if you could you if you want to use the site map if we go to a page that we don't know it will redirect us to the sitemap so next feature is internal links so internal links um, is you could actually add a keyword and an internal link internal link meaning a link within your your CS cart or your cart so for example um, when a blog is mentioned on your description it will automatically link to blog and then you also have an option to check how many times to link it for example if the keyword appears more than once you have like um, the blog is mentioned 10 times on your description but you don't want all those 10 to be linked maybe just the first three or the first two and then just click on create so if you can see we'll go to products we added one so for example you want so this is by the way how our optimization tool works so um, before I explain the tool uh, let's add the blog keyword here blog and blog please link the first two keywords Blog. So I added three um, key three keywords, three blog words, and then we save and refresh. So as you can see, oh, so I already had blog. It only linked the first two blog, and the other blogs, it did not link. 
So I um, this actually is the um, our suggestion tool. So you can check your SEO score and your keyword density and suggestions here. So it also gives you an over optimization warning if they think you're going too much with your description. So we have suggestions here. It also tells you how many keywords are in bold, uh, in italic, underline. If you have an H1, H2, or H3 heading with the keyword, your keyword density is okay. Um, suggest image with keyword in alt text not found. In internal link found, yes. Add meta keywords containing your keyword. And then this is the Bing LSI keywords. So you can also add up to three keywords now. So in here we only have pants. So let's add other keywords like um, basketball or test. Then let's save. So you can see we've added um, two more keywords. So it's still on 5%. So our keyword density is still okay. But you can see that um, pants earlier did not have any suggestion. But we have suggestions for the keyword basketball and test. So you can use these um, keywords to replace um, the ones that you mention on your description. Um, by the way, these are suggestions by the Bing um, search engine. Now let's go to our last um, feature which is the video sitemap. So on the description, let's try to embed a, a YouTube video. So let me add a YouTube video here at the end. So it's here, let's just save it. So it says video sitemap has been generated successfully. So every time you update your product or your category, or your page, it will automatically um, add those um, video on your on your description. So let's try to preview it first if we could see the video. So as you can see on the description here, yeah, we have the YouTube video. Then let's check out the video sitemap. So here, let's just click on the link and it shows us that on this location for the 100 G pounds, um, product it has this video and the video information like the title description there and that's it thank you